It was shocking news in the soccer community. Team Canada senior men's national head coach John Herdman stepping away from the organization to take over the coaching duties at TFC. Herdman just recently helped lead Canada to the World Cup, their first appearance in more than three decades, to now join a club that's won just three matches this season. Never thought I'd be leaving that Maple Leaf behind, but uh, I guess swap it for a Toronto FC uh, jersey is... It's just a huge privilege. Herdman took over the senior men's national team in 2018 and led them in 2022 to its first World Cup appearance since 1986. He leaves now just three years shy of Canada hosting World Cup matches. Coming out of Qatar, you know, to take another four, four years with Canada, you know, at that time you feel the motivation and the excitement of, you know, what you experienced there and the potential. But you also feel that there's another level to come from this team. It needs freshness. It needs a different voice. There's an element of that. But also the organization. I think the organization is undergoing a level of leadership change. And for me, this is the time. You, you feel that in your gut. You feel it in your heart. That there's a moment. It's time to step off and go and fulfill another dream. Before working with Canada's men's national team, Herdman led Canada's women's national team for several years. In his first year with the women's team, he coached them to their very first gold medal at the 2011 Pan American Games. Now he's going to be coaching a team that is at the bottom of the MLS standings. We know the size of this club. We know the potential of this club. We know what it means to, to the players like a Jonathan Azario and to bring it back to that glory of, of what we experienced with the Javinkos, and I think everyone knows what that felt like. That's the mission. It's to bring it back to win. Uh, that'll take a little bit of time. I'm hoping it doesn't take a great amount of time. Herbin will continue to help Team Canada while he transitions to his new position with TFC, where he will officially take over the coaching responsibilities on October 1st. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.